but it's mainly talking and learning the history, obviously. I know what I've got to do, though, to learn the real history of Rivet City. The truth. So many people won't tell you the real thing. Don't tell me to go that way. Learn the history of Rivet City. Yes, I am. Go down here. Well, at first, you just generally have to ask random people. Preferably people that are on the council. Nice to see you. Nice to see you, uh, Vera. She will actually mean something. Welcome to Flag and Shrapnel. You come to the right goddamn place. weapons anywhere. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, one guy speak at one time. You don't have to both introduce your place. Hello, Harkness. Hello. Hello, Gary Stally. Hey there. Privacy City Security. Welcome to Potomac Attire. Welcome to Potomac Attire. Welcome to Potomac Attire. I am Bannon, proprietor and city council member. See, he's part of the council. I carry discriminating attire for discriminating customers. Yes. <laughs> What's with your eyes? They look like failed anime eyes. See, I see you are also a person of refinement. Yeah, why not? Between you and me, keeping out the riffraff is good for business. Okay, I don't even know what refinement means. Why are you guys living on this boat? I'm here to do business. So you're on the city council. Dr. Lee, Chief Harkness, and I are all on the council. We meet every Monday morning. I can be very influential, if you know what I mean. Far more than Seagrave Holmes. Whoever the Seagrave is, he thinks it threats your influence. That's, that's why you're starting a mini side quest. A threat? No, of course not. Well, maybe. He wants mm. to replace me on the council. He's a shady character. I just can't prove it. Now, if someone were to find something incriminating in his room, well, let's just say I would be very appreciative. This guy isn't very good, is it? It's a, it's a mini side quest. It doesn't actually count for anything, but it gives you a bit of experience. So, council, why are you guys living on this boat? It's a place to live, safe from raiders and super mutants. With Dr. Lee on our side, mm. maybe we can even begin to rebuild the world. River City's history. Why, I practically set this whole place up. When I got here 12 years ago, it was just a handful of dead enders squatting in a rusted out rowboat. Now I'm on really? the council, and with my leadership, we're the strongest settlement in the wastes. Of course, a few of those dead enders still stick around, but who'd want to leave? Has River City been around for longer than 12 years? Well, yes, but it was hardly any place of importance until I arrived on the scene. That's all ancient history now. No one would ever care about it. If you insist on wasting your time on that, you could try that bartending old crone down below, Belle Bonnie. All right, then. Come back soon. Muddy rudder last night. Bannon seems yeah, very... Yeah, going to have to replace some tables and shit. Yeah, Ban does, uh, Bannon does seem very... Uh... Very, yes, I am the greatest person. So we have to talk to Bell Barney, the first, the runner of the Muddy Rudder. The Muddy, yeah. Muddy Rudder. Mud, muddy Rudder. Who the hell's shouting? I think she, she's one of the, the oldest people to be here, so she should know the truth. So let's talk to hey. Bell. I'm Bell Barney, and this is the Muddy Rudder. I'll tell you what I tell all the fresh meat. Don't start anything down here, or I'll have Brock kick your ass. Oh. Well, let's see him tackle my shish kebab. Yes. This place is a real dump. Nice place you have here. Is this, uh... I'll try and be nice, even though she won't accept it. You must be drunk. Are you gonna order, or what? <laughs> uh... So I was on this place's history. History? What, not enough shit around here already? You need to dig up more? Yep. Don't know if it ever had an official start. It's just been here forever. Stuck in the river and full of assholes. That's true. Really? Because Bannon said he organized the entire place himself. Huh. Why, that lying son of a bitch. He wasn't even born when I got here. Son Wanna know this tub's history? Fudger. Only person who really knows it is Pinkerton. And most think he's dead or gone. He's holed up in the other half of the ship. And he don't like visitors. He'll set you straight. Pinkerton, eh? Later, Bell. I'll be right here when you get thirsty. So, Pinkerton. Who is this character? I already know, because I've done this quest way too many times. 
but yeah, Pinkerton, he's possibly the oldest member of Rivet City. And he lives in the other half of the ship. That half being over... Let's just go down here. I like these jets that are still here. But yeah, the other half of the ship is right there where it's broken off. And we have to go in there. Meaning, we're going to have to do a bit of swimming. I don't know. With the laser pistol, it did some pretty good stuff. Against the Mylurks. Because, you know, flooded place. Mylurks, obviously. But I think I'm going to have to quickly leave you once more. Things are happening in the house, you see. Uh, very quickly. Two seconds. Again. Hey guys, sorry, but this is all I'm going to be recording for today. I'm going to try and sound American now. For no reason. Uh, but yeah, hope you've seen, yeah, oh god, I just have to do a bunch of running and play, uh, it's just caught up with me, anyway, hope you've enjoyed this Fallout 3, uh, I'll get some more recorded soon, but this will probably, I probably won't get this fully uploaded until the end of the week if I actually stay at it, but, thanks for watching again, hope you enjoyed it. And stay tuned for more Fallout 3 coming up soon. So until then, good night, good night.